this is easily the hardest video I've had to produce. You know, we, we wanted to put together this video really as a tribute for the White family. So they really understood just how many lives that he touched both uh, personally and uh, professionally. The sudden passing of Jordan White came as a shock to us all, you know, to, to his colleagues and to his friends within our insurance community here. Our jaws are still just on the floor. You know, he's left a huge hole here and that really says something about a guy if he leaves behind a huge hole. And, you know, Jordan was a great human being who loved his family, who had one heck of a work ethic and wanted to leave everything he did better than when he found it. I saw this daily. I saw him develop dozens of relationships within this agent community. And I, I see people leveling up in life because he selflessly took time to help them grow. He didn't have to spend time with other people. In fact, he had zero financial incentive to do so, but he did it anyway because it would better their lives by him sharing an idea or um, a concept or help them, you know, really pump them up to get out and, you know, make more sales or do things. That's just the guy he was. And I see that that fingerprint is on a lot of people within this community here uh, who try to emulate his work ethic and have spent time with him that he didn't have to spend. He just did because it helped other people. I spoke to Jordan by phone at least a couple times a week, you know, and we exchanged almost daily text messages. And even though he was the top dog here, he never gloated. He never asked for accolades. He just asked what he could do for us and what he could do for others and how how could he help others succeed like he has. He saw a lot of success uh, professionally. He wanted to share that. You know, Jordan was a, a humble beast. Um, he never showed off. He never, never took his success for granted and only ever just wanted to share it. He tried to lift everyone up, and I saw this all the time, daily. You know, I've been hunting with Jordan a couple times now, and, you know, that was truly his happy place. And even being his happy place, you know, when you go hunting, you typically want to be quiet because <laughs> you're hunting. Uh, well, Jordan isn't quiet. You know, he, he went on and on about his uh, love for his family his love for Ashley, his love for his kids. Pardon me. Um, and how he'd do anything for them. He said one time in his, uh, <clears throat> in his Jordan White, East Texas twang, you know, Nick, if I make Ashley proud, that's all that matters. Then of course, 15 minutes later, you know, we're in a turkey blind and he's on the phone making a sale again. You know, we're out there turkey hunting and he's still working, right? This guy was an animal. George, we're gonna miss you, man. To Ashley and the kids, you had a good one. We'll be here for you guys. Hopefully these, uh, these kind words from a bunch of other people within his community will help you guys heal. Hey, Jordan, um, this is really difficult, man. Uh, what I will say is this. Uh, thank you so much for inspiring all of us, uh, whether you're in a veteran agent, a rookie, and in between. You are a once in a generational agent that comes around probably once every 10 to 15, 20 years. All right. Um, the times that we did speak, uh, we did show admiration for each other. Um, but, uh, you know, you just you just the epitome of what hard work is, um, dedication and, uh, just, just doing what works and keeping things simple. All right. I pray that God comforts Ashley and the kids. And, um, I'll, I'll think about you every day, man. All right. Uh, thank you so much for inspiring all of us and, uh, just God bless you, your kids and Ashley. All right. Until we, until we meet again, man.
Thanks for everything. Ashley, this is Sandy. I just want to extend my condolences. I'm so sorry for the loss of Jordan. I met him briefly at the last mastermind in Las Vegas and got to tell him how impressive his results were. And he's just such a nice, nice, wonderful human being. And I'm so sorry for the loss. And my thoughts go out to you and your kids. I understand you're coming on board here to be an agent with us here at Digital BGA and I just want to let you know if there's anything I can do to help you in any way or anything I can do for you. I live here in Austin. You let me know. You take care. Best wishes. This message goes out to you, Jordan White, up in heaven. Uh, Ashley White, his wonderful wife, his beautiful children, Jeremy Fletcher, his brother, and his father, Rodney White. Um, Jordan was a true inspiration to everyone here. I would constantly be asked, man, what's that Jordan White doing? Wow, how's he writing all that business? We'd constantly be asked that all the time with new agents coming on board. And I said, his work ethic is through the roof. He hustles, he knows how to work. He works extremely hard doing what he did. He loved to help people. Um, but uh, again, a true inspiration. Um, it was great spending the time with you guys in Mexico at the Masterminds as well. Um, again, it's a total shock to me and to everyone here with the digital VGA family. Um, but I know he's up in heaven looking down on us and seeing what our next steps are going to be. Uh, Ashley, he was very proud of you starting very soon. But um, again, I can't say enough about him. I'm going to keep this video short. But if there's anything that you need, please reach out to us. We'll definitely be there to help you every step of the way. And I hope we continue to get to learn more about each other uh, for his sake as well. Uh, take care of yourselves. And again, Tremendous loss for all of us. Thank you. Jordan was an amazing guy. Uh, he was admired and looked up to by everyone in our organization. His work ethic, his kindness, his humility. He truly was the mark to try to achieve. He was an amazing man, very helpful and kind. Uh, just know that you and your family are in me and my family's thoughts and prayers. Got all my extended family here in Idaho praying for you. And we're here for you if we can't be. God bless you. most about Jordan White is his energy. The way he injected energy at the opening of a conversation, whether it's on the phone, in person, and a chat message, he'd be like, yo bro, what up dog? You know, what it do? I mean, I think he had like a limitless amount of openings <laughs> and it always got me fired up. And you know, I could have tons of stuff going on, but he has my full undivided attention just because of the energy and how he opened that. And I'll never forget just the way he made me feel and all that. And um, it's special. And that energy is what I know it carried him throughout his day, his his relentless work ethic. And, you know, I, I that energy, that relentless energy, I know the driving force behind it is his family. That never escaped the conversation we had. The reason why he was doing this, the goals with the family, you know, how he could spend, how, how he could spend more time and quality time and, things like that, like that was, even getting the family involved in the business, like that was all, that was the reason behind it all. And that's what makes this extremely, extremely heartbreaking. 
and you know he'll live forever in our hearts at digital bga and he made a huge mark in the industry in jordan i'm gonna miss you bro and i will see you on the flip side i am very grateful to jordan for the example that he set um, for us agents here at digital bga but also you know just for our personal interaction you know i met jordan um, in Vegas at the Mastermind, and I'm always happy to, you know, meet those who I admire, you know, and uh, Jordan, you know, not just his production numbers, but his, you know, just the personality he exhibited. You know, we, we chatted for a little while. Um, it was a busy event, but we, you know, he, he took the time to uh, chat with me off to the side, and I was blown away by the level of knowledge he had, <laughs> you know. Uh, so incredible guy and um, amazing uh, inspiration, you know, to, to me personally, you know, as an aspiring husband and father, you know, I'd love to see uh, the family picks and just, just knowing that he's such a hard worker and a family man and, you know, God bless you all. You know, uh, God is certainly with you and the family now. Uh, I have, I certainly offer my condolences and I uh, hope that you find comfort uh, in Jordan's memory and in God. Uh, God bless you, uh, Jordan, Jordan White's family. Take care. Hi, Ashley. This is Kristen Meyer. I'm a digital BG agent. I had the wonderful opportunity of meeting your husband at one of our conferences. I uh, just wanted to wish you all the love and support through this difficult time. I'm so sorry for the loss of Jordan for you and your family. Um, I know that he impacted us as agents and you have all of our support behind you. And I just wanted to let you know if you ever need anything, please feel free to reach out to any of us and how we can be of assistance because we're here to back you and that's what we do at Digital. I wish you all the best, many hugs to you and your kids, many blessings. I didn't know Jordan uh, very well. I had met him uh, once or twice and uh, mainly just chatted with him online uh, from time to time about you know issues with carriers and different things we're going through. I always enjoyed uh, getting you know his feedback on what he's experiencing. Uh, but three things I, I, I do know about him. Um, number one, he's an extremely hard worker, uh, worked very hard. Number two, he loved his family very much. And number three, he loved the Lord. Um, so I'm very, very sad to hear of his his passing. Uh, but thankfully, we, we do not grieve as those with no hope because uh, we know exactly where he is. Um, and uh, we look forward to seeing him again. And uh, we're praying for his family his wife and his kids as they uh, go through this time uh, but very uh, thankful for him and his life Hey guys, my name is Brandon Johnson. Uh, this past December, uh, I was kind of at a low point in my business. Uh, I was just trying to figure some things out. Things have not been going my way. So I reached out to Jordan and uh, just for some advice to see really what he was doing. Uh, he spent countless hours with me on the phone, uh, texting back and forth. We were just chatting about life and getting to know one another. He was such a an awesome guy and such a selfless dude. and and uh yeah i mean we would um you know he would text me at the end of the day when i'd go out in the field and uh, door knocking and and uh you know ask me how my day had gone and he encouraged me uh whether it was good or bad and i just can't say enough about him uh i loved enjoyed getting to know him um you know learning about him his family and how he loved uh hunting trips with his dad and brother and and how he just adored his family um, I cannot say enough about the guy, his selflessness, his humility in light of all the success that he had, uh, most successful final expense, uh, agent that I know of brother, you are going to be missed and you're, you definitely left your mark on this world. I'll be praying for your family. They say, you know, many, but you walk with few. Well, I got to walk with Jordan White for the last two years and we quickly became very good friends. And I was so blessed here a few months ago and he, he said, man, you're my best friend. You're my bro. And I said, you know what, Jordan? I said, 
you really are, brother. Uh, just you know, guys don't say, "Hey, I love you, man," but you're awesome. But you know, that's how that's the kind of relationship that we had, and our wives would joke with us that you guys talk to each other more than you talk to us, and we, we literally would talk five to seven times a day. And I got to listen to over 150 presentations that Jordan gave. I heard him get cussed out, yelled at. I had pe heard people slam doors on him. And that's hard to believe for a guy that did $24,000 in AP in one day. That's hard to believe for a guy that did $114,000 in only 18 days. But it happens. And Jordan was very quick to point out, man, it's a numbers game. Don't let the grass grow under your feet, man. Just get on to the next one. Get on to the next one. And you know, those of you that knew Jordan knew he was a big, avid hunter. Boy, if it had antlers or had hooves or a gobbler, he probably, he probably killed it. And I, I've got some of his deer meat and turkey meat in my freezer. He said, man, I can't eat all this. But he, he just had a huge heart. And I mean, even on his last day on earth, he was he called me up to have me assist him helping a lady on a death claim. And uh, you know, Jordan loved Ashley, his wife, and he, he loved Madison and Jackson and Taylor, his children. And, but you know, he loved Jesus Christ as his Lord and Savior. And I can tell you right now, he didn't want to be remembered as a guy that just had UJP and made big sales. He'd want to be remembered as, as a man of God who loved Jesus Christ as his Lord and Savior. He wasn't a perfect man, but he was a man that loved Jesus. And so I know he's walking on the streets of gold. And he and I sometimes would hang up and I'd say, Hey bro, I'll talk to you again, either here or there, or in the air. Well, I'll talk to you again, Jordan. I love you, bro. Hey, my name is Cami Adams. I just wanted to share a little bit about Jordan White. I came from the face-to-face uh, -face world, just like he was in, and Nick and Jeff threw out a challenge of riding 100K in a month, and he accepted and blew it out of the water. And I think about the legacy that he is leaving behind with all of those thousands of families that he was able to help. His work ethic and tenacity was like nothing I've ever seen. And he was a pretty nice guy also. We are thinking about you guys, Ashley and the kids and Jeremy and praying for all of you through this unimaginable time. Just know that we are here for you and the Digital BGA community loves all of you. Take care. Jordan White, my beloved brother and my very best friend. Jordan, I want you to know that since the day you left us, there hasn't been a single moment that my mind hasn't been filled with all of the thoughts and memories of the time that we shared together. Jordan, you were a barrier breaker. You challenged the status quo and taught us to never see an obstacle, but to always believe in and reach for the opportunity. And Jordan, it was that spirit that lived on the inside of you and that truly lives on beyond you that caused you to succeed at the highest level. I'm so grateful to be called your brother and consider it one of the highest honors of my life. And until we meet again, I want you to know you will be sorely missed. Thank you for the life that you lived and the love that you gave and the lessons that you left. We truly love you and we'll miss you for an eternity. Thank you.